To install ChatGPT's Atlas browser on your Mac, launch a web browser of your choosing, such as Chrome or Safari, and navigate to chatgpt.com atlas. Then, click on the Download for Mac OS button in the upper right of the page, and your download will begin. Depending on the browser you're using, you may be able to monitor the download progress at the top of the window. Once the install file is downloaded, you can launch it directly from your browser or navigate to Finder in the bottom left of your desktop, select Downloads in the sidebar, and then double-click on the ChatGPT Atlas DMG file to launch the installer. In the new window that appears, click and drag the ChatGPT Atlas icon into your Applications folder and wait for it to copy. Then, close the installer window and click on Applications in the Finder sidebar. Locate and double-click on ChatGPT Atlas. Click Open if a security prompt appears, and then the application will launch. Now, before logging in and fully launching the browser, we can clean up a couple things. If you still have your other browser open, go ahead and close it. Next, close the Finder window. You may also see the Atlas installer mounted on your desktop. Right-click or hold Control and click on the icon and select Eject from the menu that appears to unmount it. And finally, click and hold on the Atlas icon in your dock, go to Options, and select Keep in Dock from the menu. This will make sure that Atlas stays in your dock for easy access, but of course this is optional. And that's it for installation. You can now click the Login with ChatGPT button in the Atlas browser window. You will be prompted to choose a method to log in, or you can sign up for a new ChatGPT account. In my case, I'm logging in with my Google account credentials. Next, you will be walked through a few optional setup steps such as importing bookmarks from another browser, keychain access, which will require your Mac admin password if allowed, browser memories, Ask ChatGPT, cursor collaboration, and also the option to set Atlas as your default browser. Of course, you can also skip these and set them up later in the browser settings menu. Finally, click Done on the final step, and the browser window will appear all ready to go. Since this was an installation video, I won't go into many details about using the browser, as I need to explore more myself, but it's pretty cool how it integrates with ChatGPT. There are tons of features you can explore within the browser and browser settings, and also by scrolling down at chatgpt.com atlas. I'll probably make a couple more videos as I learn more myself, but hopefully this video helped get the browser installed, launched, and into a basic setup. As always, if you found this video helpful, please consider liking and subscribing. Thanks!